Hi everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's Aaron Ryan back with you once again. Okay, so uh, there's something I've been trying to do for quite some time and I've noticed that uh, there's not really a proper tutorial for uh, iPhone users in regards to uh, transfer Lightroom presets from Lightroom on your computer to your iPhone. Now these are especially um, XMP files. So instead of kind of converting them one by one to um, a DNG file, which is a mobile uh, kind of format for your uh, iPhone to load into Lightroom Mobile. But uh, I found another kind of easier way to transfer all of your presets to your iPhone. And it's very, very quick. It's very easy as well. So for today, just, just to give an example, I'm going to be transferring the RNI Films uh, 5 Pro versions to uh, my iPhone and uh, they're really nice presets here some nice black and white ones that I kind of want to use on the iPhone instead of having uh, where you're kind of stuck to editing photos on your computer well it's kind of handy to um, edit your photos as well on mobile devices as well so these are the kind of ones I do want to transfer over so Instead of using iTunes, I noticed in iTunes uh, lately there's a lot of error messages I'm getting in. Uh, there's another video about uh, transferring presets in iTunes, but uh, I've, I've came across some kind of problems with iTunes lately. So I found another good program here. It's called Tree U Tools. Now Tree U Tools have um, a lot of great kind of. Uh, categories here you can transfer your photos your videos you can add music even add ringtones as well and all sorts of stuff but you can actually access files inside apps as well so I'm going to click on apps here and uh, it's going to show me a list of all the apps I have here so I'm going to go down to Lightroom and I'm going to click on view here so now I'm going to be shown here, which is um, a folder with a lot, a lot of numbers and a lot of letters in it. So this is the folder we want here, okay? So we're gonna click on, double click on this folder. And you wanna go into settings-acr and also go into the folder and user styles. Now, in here, this is where you're going to import the presets. So you're gonna click on import you're going to go on to uh, select folder okay so now i need to navigate to where i have the presets stored in on lightroom so uh, that's in your c and um, it's in users it's in your name and um, it's also in app data in roaming in adobe in camera raw and in settings okay so it's, it's kind of a long journey isn't it to get to your presets but uh, there's where they are so um i'm going to be transferring the rni folders i yeah you cannot highlight every single folder so you have to do this one by one so uh for example R, you have to uh get in the pro and the profiles if these presets have profile folders include them as well so i'm going to import uh, the black and white one first so just like that 34 files has just been imported straight away there and that was very very fast um open back up again into profiles do the same for every single one and then you will have all of the presets the uh the new one aero chrome ones are here as well i actually enjoy those presets too there's something called uh, infrared on this, but I don't know why. But uh, but just for example, I'm going to transfer all of these just to show you that uh, they do in fact work. I like that when you click on select folder, it does remember the folder you're at. And it also remembers the one you last clicked on as well, which is kind of handy because you could get mixed up and add in uh the presets again by accident you know <laughs> you don't want to add them in twice or, or three times you know so um i'm at negative now negative profiles to add these also include the green grainy presets as well if you let the green effect on them as well they're already there for you as well so i'm going to use the slide as well and the slide profiles and then have vintage as well then last 
Okay, so vintage is last to do. Vintage Pro and vintage profiles. Okay, now we are done. Okay, so now that you transferred your presets from 3U tools on your computer to your your phone, you can go on and open up the Lightroom mobile app now. So if you did have the app open at start, well, just close it off again and reopen the app again, okay? So they're gonna appear in your profiles tab at the bottom and also in presets down here as well. So uh, there they all are. So as usual, they all work, which is perfect. All the presets work. They're all there and they're also in profiles as well they appear here i'd rather use just the presets folder because it's kind of difficult i find to uh navigate in this area but uh, in presets they're all there and you can go on and edit all your photos so i do hope uh, this video helped you out i will provide the link as well in the description to download Trio tools it's a free program and uh, i do hope this has helped you out uh, if you have subscribed already, thank you very, very much. And uh, please do subscribe to me for future videos as well. Thank you very much for watching, guys, and I will catch you all very soon. Take care.